Soldiers from U.S. Army Aviation Battalion Japan out of Camp Fuji fly down to Yokosuka Naval Base and work with sailors from both Yokosuka and Naval Air Facility Atsugi to train on personnel water rescue techniques. This particular exercise is a training validation of the Army's caving ladder, or more commonly called rope ladder, and their ability to adjust to the various factors in case of a real emergency. Uh, I think it went really well. There was uh, a couple things that uh, we had a little bit more uh, wind and a little bit of drift, so we uh, compensated and uh, changed a couple things or uh, delayed a little bit, uh, adjusted the exercise uh, safely in order to accomplish the training. It was a very good event today. This training puts every unit to the test and forces everyone to think and act as one. From adjusting the Army's helicopter flight approach in the sky, steerage and control from Yokosuka's security boats on the water, to Itsugi's safety swimmers in the water, they all work together to make this event come off without a hitch. We prepared for weeks on this, uh, this evolution and we thought we anticipated everything that we could possibly anticipate, but one thing that uh, that was kind of hard today was the current. The sea state was a little rough um, and the current pushed us around like crazy. So next time around we will kind of anticipate that, making sure that our swimmers do not get fatigued and making sure that we are helping our swimmers to the best of our ability. In order to get a full understanding of the two services capabilities, both the Army and Navy deploy their aircraft to recover personnel. The Army requires five rescues through the use of the caving ladder, and the Navy requires two pickups by using the helicopter's hoist and search and rescue swimmer to assist in the recovery. Overall, the participants feel like this cross-branch training is beneficial. It was actually a great opportunity. It was the first time I've worked with anyone other than the Navy, honestly, and just to be able to understand their aircraft, their capabilities, and to share our capabilities, our aircraft configuration, is definitely an interesting and an awesome experience. Um, I look forward to doing it again. I hope that next year we're able to repeat this exercise and just continue to help each other out and continue to do operations like this. Well, we just appreciate the support that the Navy uh, did and. Uh, also getting to uh, be hoisted in their helicopter was a, a great event for myself as well as my operations officer. The caving ladder training went well. Rescue swimmers helped out immensely having the safety boats uh, available. We appreciate getting opportunities to train like this as much as possible. Both services hope to plan this event again next year and continue to build on this training environment. Petty Officer Brian M. Brooks, Yokosuka Naval Base, Japan.